today we are in the beautiful watermelon fields and we are going to be talking about watermelons but these watermelons are not just any watermelons they are watermelons that are grown in the ground and today we are going to meet with some of the locals who have been planting watermelons their whole lives our first person that we're going to meet is from right here in Xiang Shan, which is called the fragrant hill which is located in Jiangwei city in Ningxia northwest China now I will invite Mrs. Chen to come and tell us a little bit more about how they do this. Mrs. Chen. Why 干旱少雨是这里农业生产的主要因素在一年有一年这个大海之年人们发现在那个黄山地上有沙是覆盖的地方做物能很好的生长从此人们就采取了那个压沙种植作物的这种抗害种植模式它的跟去水宝上非常效果这么好好的我们做的没有简单的实验啊就是这是没有这个盒子是沙石毁合物这个盒子里头是那个沙土我们现在看看它那个渗水的那个效果沙石毁合物它那个渗水的效果就是特别
块要钱。大西瓜能达到十一就不错了。嗯，我们这个可以达到十三点四，这就是我刚刚才的那个状态。松哥，你种了几年？我从小就种西瓜，嗯、呃，父辈就是种西瓜嘛，嗯，一直跟着父母种，呃，最起码有二十多年了。啊、嗯呃，小时候种瓜可苦了，嗯，那时候然后干啥呢？靠天吃饭，没有水，呃，种出来西瓜然后干啥？质量也不是太高。嗯。我小时候记得，然后去，经常就是和爸爸，开着手扶拖拉机，然后去拿西瓜换粮食，哎、呃，你然后呢，粮食它能放得住，西瓜放不了。嗯，现在可不一样了，现在我们这，什么就是，那个黄河水也引到这边了。嗯嗯，我们再一个就是现在这个地膜。嗯。品质也越来越好了，好，哎、呃，也也、呃、有更多的那个客商愿意来我们这买西瓜了。嗯，像现在我们这全国二十多个省的，北京、上海，哎、嗯呃，广州，啊、嗯，好多地方都会来，甚至就是我们的西瓜可以走到香港、西藏。He can make possibly one million RMB with one hundred acres. Can you imagine how much money that is, especially coming from the hardship that he had before? So you see. Through science and through hard work, these farmers were able to completely change their lives through the use of new technology and making sure that they have a passion for watermelon. And he was telling us that 95%, 95% of the people in this county have cars. Can you imagine that? Coming from a place of poverty to 95% of the population with cars, it's just simply amazing. And I'm just so inspired by what they're doing.